Hey everybody, this is William Baxter, and this is uh, the last movie review for 2018. Uh, year went by pretty quick. Uh, I'm sure you've already, uh, hopefully, some of you've already watched the video with uh, Ocean and I thanking everybody. Um, a few nights ago, uh, the wife and I uh, decided to spend some quality time and Netflix and chilled, whatever the saying is. And uh, she said she'd been hearing about uh, this movie, The Bird Box, that's a uh, Netflix original that starred Sandra Bullock. Um, I can't remember the name of the director right offhand, uh, female director. Um, I'm gonna say that uh, this movie uh, surprising, was surprisingly good. Um, I texted Paul and told him about this movie and he says, yeah, he had heard about it, that um, some people were calling it a ripoff from A Quiet Place, which starred Emily Blunt and her husband who directed it um, but uh, I hadn't seen that one yet so that worked to my advantage for this movie but yet again you know any movie that copies another format of a film in a way isn't necessarily th that bad so a lot of movies especially horror films copied the same pattern you know especially back in the 80s so um, I'm just gonna say this this was a very good movie very well written very well acted um, Sa Sandra Bullock uh, did a really good job at you know it, as she always does in most of her films uh, it also starred John Malkovich um, uh, some of the actors you may recognize here and there I can't remember most of them off the bat um, but uh, this movie was just very well good very well written um, it flashed back and forward a lot when it came to the scenes, uh, so uh, it just it just really was a nice suspenseful film. Um, I said that's the best I can describe. It was nice and suspenseful. It was like it felt like you know like a modern day Hitchcock type of film or something John Carpenter could have done too. Um, and you know, and that's saying a lot. And it, I can't, I wish I can remember the name of the director. It was right on the tip of my tongue until I started recording. But she did a really good job. Um, and this movie really, as I said, taken from a format that was kind of done before. I mean, whatever movies you want to call it, happening, or, you know, Quiet Place, or any of those type of uh, end of the world apocalyptic style films. Uh, this movie was very well done. Um, people, for some reason, they they are seeing something that's causing them to either harm themselves, kill themselves, or go mad and try to uh, force people to see whatever it is that is haunting uh, the human population. And the only way that they know that dangers are around, that these, whatever they are, demons or entities or whatever, is that the birds kind of go crazy. So, um, as you said, in the beginning of the film, You'll see the the hints when you she when you start flashing back to the scene where they open up that Sandra Bullock and these two little children are on a river, so uh, it backtracks all the way up to the point at the end of the film. So I said it it it's really good. It was just very well done, and I highly recommend this movie. I give it about a, a seven. That's, that, you know, for a Netflix original film, not a lot of Netflix movies are that good, necessarily. But um, I'm giving this one a seven, because this was really, really good. I really enjoyed it. Um, I was very intrigued about what was going on towards the end, especially at the end of the film, when you thought something was bad's gonna happen, and then it ended up not happening. Uh, not to give out any spoilers, which I will not do, but um, I said, just uh, check it out. It's called The Bird Box, starring Sandra Bullock. Uh, it's on Netflix, streaming service. Uh, you can watch it at any time. I don't know when or where it's going to come out on DVD or Blu-ray. I'm sure it will. But, um, you know, a lot of people have been giving it hype. Um, I, luckily, I didn't pay attention to any of all that. or I just came in blindly, <laughs> which is, you know, kind of the... Um, kind of a subtext towards this movie so uh, I again uh, check it out it's called the bird box I gave it a seven out of my rating system so 
and um, I will uh, see you all next year. Thanks again for uh, watching everything that I've done this year, and uh, thanks for all the subscribers for subscribing to my channel and watching and giving me some really good views and likes. So please uh, hit the thumbs up on this video and uh, the thank you video that Ocean and I did. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe and check out the uh, next year. I'll have a Patreon hopefully to support this channel as I mentioned previously. And also, um, you know, share this video. Those who um, have not seen this movie, if they are curious about it, you know, share this video to those people, you know, if they want someone's opinion, if they even care about anyone's opinion, um, you know, please, by all means, check it out. And uh, leave a comment on the below and every, on the uh, comment section below. Uh, let me know what you thought of the movie. So, um, again, I'm uh, giving it a seven. That's my opinion. Um, this has been William Baxter on the uh, William Baxter Experience. This has been That Review Show. Thanks for watching, and please keep watching.